Hey YouTube, how you doing? This is Joe over at Allen Ed's Auto Sound in Marina Del Rey, 310-827-8121. Just got done working on a customer's 2008 Range Rover Sport. So they weren't a very big fan of the rear mounted auxiliary input behind the console and behind the little door. So what we did is I removed those uh, inputs in the rear, put them and hid them inside the console, plugged an auxiliary cable in, and rerouted it to an iPod specific 30 pin docking connection. So with this cable we're able to get pre out from the bottom of the iPod, better audio, it's not volume controlled, and I'm able to charge it as well. So the cable I brought out from the top glove compartment, you're able to close the lid over the cable without damaging it, and now you could have a true docking connection to the bottom of your iPod and still run it through the factory aux. Not only does it sound better, less distortion, it also is, allows you to charge it all at the same time. Once again, this was Joe over at Allen Ed's Auto Sound in a 2008 Range Rover Sport with an upgraded iPod dock connection via the factory auxiliary input. Once again, this was Joe at Allen Ed's. 310-827-8121. Thanks, guys.